Welcome to a very interesting remix. It's Control Mage. It's OTK Mage. It's in one deck now. The Madman! Alright, Jade and Druid. It's the matchup where Exodia can shine. One of the few decks that can beat that deck, which is a control deck. One of the few control decks which can beat that deck without skulking Geist in it. Keeping in mind that this is usually a control deck and just plays and wins with Jaina, but against certain matchups like this one, you know, build specifically for the combo. Can I use the coin here? Yeah, I'll toss it out for the tempo. Since I can start pinging this thing. Why not just run Control Mage with Geist? Well, part of it is because this is the early season and, you know, doing crazy science experiments is good. If I wanted to win, I would just play Raza Priest right now. But it has its advantages and disadvantages. Suffice it to say. Hmm, guess we'll let a miracle for a turn? How bad could it be? Oh, that's a good draw. Excuse me, you are on fire right away. That's pretty old school to run auctioneer. Why would you need auctioneer in that deck? We've got draw five already for ten mana. Right away. But one of the problems with this deck, uh, with the Acolyte of Pains, is you can often draw too many cards, but... Surprisingly, I can actually hold the cards here, it seems. I'm actually drawing at a rate which is so fast that I think I'll be able to complete the combo in a decent amount of time. So Frost, uh, Firelands Portal is the best answer, other than that I have no real answer. Meteor is a answer. Uh, I guess I'll use it here. So there's like a checklist of things to do. First step, draw Sources Apprentice. Check. Second step, cast Simulacrum twice. Third step, cast Slowline Manipulator. Fourth step, have the Antonitis. Have the Molten Reflection. And the three Sources Apprentices in hand. As a note, I only need one Sorcerer's Apprentice, so I'll toss one of these out. The second one is actually completely useless. Like you. I need to actually get this card out of my hand, so I guess I'll Intellect here. Hmm, I guess this is better. That also draws a card right now. No, wait. There was a reason why I didn't want to draw a card. It's because I overdraw one. Oh! The ruin. Oh my god. Right. 
It's okay. Maybe he didn't notice. He didn't notice. actually have all the pieces. I just need to cast Leyline Manipulator and then I need to draw Antonius. So I, I need two more pieces in other words. Also, Dragon's Fury is really good right now. Deals at least six tall. Uh, we are smoothing. We are chugging along here. And if I play the ley line and then I draw the Antonitis, I win the game. But probably better to start with Polymorph. It could be better to just play ley line now. Yeah, I guess we'll wait a turn. The next turn is ley line, Arcane Intellect. Draw into Antonitis, hopefully. If not, I still have quite a lot of time. With this ice block and that ice block. You have the theory to clear for a 6 or 7. It's looking like a very secure win. If I get a 7, I can actually play this. The main problem with Leyline Intellect is if I draw exactly Meteor Flame Strike, I'd be pretty unlucky to draw exactly two cards out of five. I mean, at the same point, there's really no reason to rush things. Unfortunately, I can't play Arcane Artificer to also gain infinite armor due to not having enough mana. Assembled all the pieces of the combo. So we want to kill off these jades while we're at it. By the extra despair. Yeah. <laughs> 